What's up everybody? This is Nun Defense on the Nun Defense account on the team Grublet YouTube. Here on this team, if you attack poorly, you will be made fun of on YouTube. Now, don't let that scare you, team. Like, come on, you know. I'm Ultimately, it's for comedy. Comedy, remember, trying to keep people to laughing. I'm feeling tons of extra energy today, and let me tell you why. If you don't know who this gentleman is, Mr. Spin Drift, he was on the team back in the day, and damn, he was good. Damn, he was good. Word got out. He found out. I, I don't even know who communicated with him or if he found us on the YouTubes or whatever. Either way, he found us. He's back. He's going to run some Zookas for us. Not this operation because he just joined. And, and th we're just kind of doing a lame op anyway. Uh, but I'm super excited about that. And I just want y'all to remember this name. Spin Drift. He's really good. Loves to play. Glad he's with us. He's going to do some beautiful, beautiful things. Another name I can't show you, but his name is Bron Soon. Bron, we called him. He's trying to reactivate one of his old accounts and see if he can get over here as well. So, tons of activity. We're having a great time. Remember, we are currently, uh, what, nine members short of a full roster. So, if you're watching this and you want to get in on the action... Come on over, man. You don't have to run all Zookas. I don't know why people think my team requires it. It doesn't. What my team requires is solid, consistent attacks. And if you need help learning how to do solid, consistent attacks, we will teach you how to do solid, consistent attacks. This is not complicated. This is a video game. It's supposed to be fun. Whew, man, I am just feeling so much energy. This is great. All right, so I am going to go ahead and do some attacks. Well, two attacks. I intend to. I'm going to hookah this thing dead. I'm reasonably confident that I could just go in and get it unboosted as is with some, uh, you know, careful, careful planning and shocking. But nah, I don't feel like doing all that. I'm going to run a clearing attack on Angie. And here we are on the Boom Bitch Angie account. That's BBA for short. Let me just quickly click her thing so I know that I did that. Working on getting her powder. It's a process, but we will get through it. We will get through it. Okay. I went ahead and loaded her up with uh, these clone troops. The, the clone riflemen that are uh, happening right now. Just to kind of, I'm not going to try to do anything crazy with them, but it says Rifleman, but it's not Rifleman, it's the Clone Troops. Cool. Um, also, I noticed, I haven't really taken advantage of it, uh, the Rifleman Life Leech. Why not? Why not? I like Rifleman. I'll actually, I'll actually use that. Uh, Scorcher Health. I'll take the Scorcher Health. Okay, Bombardier Speed. I don't know if I want that because that affects my timing and so many of my attacks are timing dependent. When you, when you start messing with things to change the timing, I feel like I get weaker, not stronger. Um, hmm, can't go back on that. I wish there was a way to uh, upgrade it and downgrade it at the same time. You know, like Gopher's like, ooh, too much, too much. Uh, but whatever, it's for a video. Let's just go ahead. We're going to max them out. So next time we do run Scorcher Deer this week uh, for the next 12 days, we'll have a, we'll, we'll make it work. And smoke screen duration. Again, that, that messes with my timing. I'm going to leave that alone because that's a timing thing. And I do a lot of hacks and I really, I don't know. I'm going to just leave that alone. I don't feel, I've, I've never felt the need like, oh, I wish my smokes lasted longer. Sometimes I wish they lasted just a little bit shorter because sometimes waiting for them is just agony. Okay, anyway, I've talked. So, I, this is just being a goofy, not trying really hard to do anything. We're just going to go do a little bombing run. We're going to come around here and up here and just see uh, how many troops we get out of this. Uh, 28 times 8. Someone remember the math on that, but that's how many uh, riflemen that we're sending in on this, uh, on this project. I'm going to use her garage to clear this stuff once I get in position, these mines, and then for your, I'll go ahead and bomb these rockets. That'll just open up the beach there, make the, the next run a little bit easier because I'm going to hookah myself right underneath the shock launcher. And then once that, as that uh, thing happens, I'm going to shock the necessary things and clear this little area. And it's going to be lovely. It's going to be fun. We're going to have a good time. So let's go begin our good time now. Uh, this is unboosted. 
for anyone who likes to keep track of that, this is unboosted. So to start, let's go ahead, heat up some of this gunboat. Okay, so this is kind of a silly run. If the uh, if the team was desperate, if we didn't have like what it feels like 50 attacks on reserve right now, uh, I would not make this run. I would uh, do something else. You know, I would uh, you know be a little more forceful. I don't know. It would just depend on the situation. But I have the luxury of time to run this silly little attack. So I just want to. Uh, I thought this would be a fun opportunity to watch these uh, watch these little riflemen do what they do with their little cloning powers. But they only clone when they die, right? Or are they like cloning right now in front of me and I just don't realize it? Okay, so they're up there. They're safe. I'm gonna give them one more flare. Send them up that way. Cool. What's happening? Oh, those are the critters. Gotcha. All right, cool. So now let's do this little bombing run here. Barrage, barrage, barrage. Cool. That should just ensure that my, my uh, wayward zookas don't step on a mine because that is the most annoying thing in the world. When everything is more or less fine, and then your zookas go stepping on a mine, and then they're all gone. All right, send them up here. Get them away from the shock launcher. They'll either make it or they won't. It's up to them. All right. Now let's bomb this. One, two. See what kind of damage two does. Three, four. Five, six. All right, start barrage. Another one. Well, that was artillery, but y'all knew what I meant. So close. See you over there, Rocket. I see you over there, Rocket. Let's see. What else can I do over here? Anything interesting that's you know, really going to be beneficial? I mean, I'll weaken these, I guess, just to do something. <coughs> uh, I'll crit those mics. Why not? Cool. Hope y'all are enjoying the content. I've been uh, speeding up the, you know, the video speed and audio speed of that. If you hate it, please tell me. If you love that, please tell me. Just throw, continue to just weaken up those shock launchers. I intend to fight them, but if they're just a little bit weaker, I mean, it certainly doesn't hurt. What are we doing back here? We're just, we're just doing whatever. Throw these zookas, or uh, critters. So cool. That was just a fun little run. Just blowing things up. Having little battles all over the place. Having a good time. <clears throat> Any minute now. This will be over. I'm surprised it's lasted this long. I mean, I knew it was going to be a fun run, but I didn't know it was going to be a long fun run. All right, cool. Yeah, we did that. Casualties, 213. Alright, cool. Now I'm going to swap over to uh, Nun Defense. And we are here on Nun Defense. I've went ahead and subbed in Sergeant Brick with Battle Orders. And let's go ahead and just hop to it. Now, to be clear, uh, that previous run that I just did on Angie, I could have used Grubbler for the more or less accomplished the same thing, um, but he was he was unavailable. He was already attacked, which I may or may not have shown that attack at the point that you're watching this video. Hard to know for, for me to know at this prep point. All right, so when we do this, make sure we do everything right. Check the range on that. Cool. So we've got plenty of space over here. Don't worry about that. So we've got a player at that corner. And we want the Zookas off first. All right, we want this to go. We're going to want the Zookas off first. This brick and the, and the Hookahs off last. So, player corner. Got it. All right, got this in my mind. Here we go. So we flare the corner. We drop the zookas. One, two, three, four. Okay. Drop. Yeah. Boom, 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 and boom. Leave my heavies alone. Okay, doing fine. That was not a problem. And boom, boom, boom. Killing it, killing it. One more shot for good measure. And get rid of that one machine gun. We'll do a reposition, which we've done. Chop these mortars just to make sure. And one more battle orders. Make it. There you go. Nothing fancy. And that's how you run a hookah. <clears throat> I've seen it run better. You have to. Uh, but that that's it. If you can just do some version of that, you know, just, uh, you know, some... If you can get... I don't know if I can get everybody, if, if everybody on the team is a level 7 out of 10 smoker, we can make some magic, magic, baby. So cool, uh, we did that, that was fun, uh, so yeah, we're keeping this video short and snappy, um, I've got the grublet attack from earlier, alright, I just started this operation, as we all know, and I'm just going to do this grublet recording real quick, while this base is open, so my man Sal went in and asked him to create an opening for me, and uh, he said okay. So he did. So not only did he go and clear a path for me of all these defenses, Jesus, kitties. My freaking kitties, man. Should get video of them. That'd be YouTube gold. Anyway, so uh, he asked me to, or asked him to clear uh, some area, and he cleared a bunch of defenses and did the, the great teammate thing of leaving me a bunch of power cells so I can handle this from here. Oh, he replied. So he said, I got it. Let me just jump in there before he tries too hard. <laughs> I asked him to get the shock launchers, but I mean, any opening that he would have created would have been fine. And, uh, I got the juice, don't worry about it. As long as he, I mean, he gave me plenty of power, power cells, 
to, to uh, work on. So we'll just use it. Take advantage. One more artillery. Boom. Now we mortar that. Uh, mortar. Well, we barrage the mortars. I'm trying to say English, Mr. Smith. English. Okay. Throw another barrage at that. Let's be easy peasy. Okay. Let's go ahead and get these guys here. Yeah, I don't even need any of that extra gunboat now. Sal did such a bang up job making it stupid easy for me. Like stupid easy. So we're just gonna go up here, we're gonna walk right up to that rocket and say, hello rocket, we're here to visit. Just, just go in and visit. This is unboosted. Again, we'll be doing tinderbox just for a little while until we can get our roster full and uh, the intel generation. The the downside of a tinderbox with a 10-man team uh, versus a 25-man team is the amount of uh, intel, the op cost. And you've got to generate new intel, so that's why we need new members. We don't need all of the new members to be, you know, complete badasses. We just need them to generate some intel, attack consistently, consistently. I use that word consistently. Some people think they watch these videos and they think I want everybody to have hero runs. I don't. I swear I don't. We don't need hero runs. We need just a bunch of consistent runs. And from a bunch of consistent runs, we will create hero moments. That's how it works. And Spindrift joined the team. Braun is trying to join the team. Crab is awesome. Dawn is awesome. Sal is awesome. Commander, we still we still haven't seen much. I've been this this thing's been sitting here for twelve hours. Arctic got a, an attack in, but it was terrible. So you know, like it's not even. It was so bad it wasn't even worth worth being, making fun of. Just he he's way under leveled, and he sent tanks after boom cannons. So, double double dunce there. Alright, I guess I'll go ahead and wrap this video up. Friends, thank y'all so much for taking time out of your day, out of your life, out of your just moments of this strange little roller coaster of an existence we get to ride together. We're spending it together. Fist bump, high five, thumbs up, love you. Bye.